What's good? I'm doing fine. What about good you guys? Hear. We're doing good. We're doing good. We just watched you guys uh, play some uh, some Dota 2, and it was a little bit of a back and forth, that second game. How do you guys look at that second game of Dota but that you just played? Um... I, I we were really confident the entire game. I think the issue was that they have like a draft that's extremely good at picking off with LC Duel, with Storm, uh, with Chi Locate. So for the first like 20 minutes when we were farming our items and stuff, it was really easy for them to pick us off and we died like a lot of times. But I mean, we just knew that when we go five men, there's no way they can, they can beat us. And Charlie diving tier fours was part of the plan. <laughs> Yes, yes, the, we, we discussed that and we told him, you know, Charlie, go ham and, and he did. Didn't work I out have, in the end, but what can yeah. you do? I have a question for you. What happened to NIP in the Immortal League? Like, I have higher expectations for you guys. <laughs> you probably did for yourself. Where was this NIP? Where was this Charlie and Saber Light? Uh, honestly, I don't know. Like, it's, I don't want to. Like, say, Cyber Legacy is a bad team, they're really good, but I feel like like these two games were just so much easier than uh, than the ones we played in the Mortal League, because I actually don't know why, but I, I felt like I didn't do much, like, either of these two games, but it was just so easy. Yeah, I, that's Maybe like... we just got better, maybe it's just, like, easier, but I don't know. I was just going to ask, what's, like, the leadership construct for your team? Uh, obviously, you got Misha coming standing in, and you had you were kind of questioning who's your pos five, you know, trialing a lot of players. What, like, who is like your big drafter, the guy who is making the calls? Is it Misha or is it like a combination of all of you together? Uh, well, we have also coach OKC. Yep. And so what's usually, what usually happens is that Era, uh, Misha and OKC are, are practicing draft. They're looking at what we want to play with at like strats and stuff. In, inside of the game, like everyone is making calls and Misha is the, the main one making calls. Okay, nice. Okay. And how's that? How's it been going? Because you guys, you know, probably not are where you wanted to be. You wanted to be in the Immortal Players, you're in the Divine Playoffs. We talked about what you guys would have learned in the group stages for the Immortal Bracket. What do you feel like you guys have learned during those group stages that you are implementing right now? For us, I think it's mainly about like playing as a team and our drafting and stuff. Because I mean, honestly, I think uh, we didn't play our best in the in the group stage. So I think we just we just needed to like regroup and and try to do our best. And I feel like in this series, we we kind of did. Okay. Well, I'm looking forward to seeing you play in the next uh, upper bracket match. Thank you for uh, taking the time to talk to us, and uh, we'll talk to you maybe next time. Mm. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you, Saberlight. Thank you. Bye.